What's up guys, Brutal Bates back with another E-Juice review from Naked100. Uh, seems to be very popular on my channel. Uh, I'm a fan of Naked100, if you couldn't tell. Now, I'm finally starting on the Naked 100 menthol line. As of right now, I'm pretty sure that they only have three flavors. Uh, well, three menthol flavors. Um, well, actually, I think one of them isn't even menthol. It's like culotta. But, you know, cold e liquid, you know, you get that cold sensation or whatever. So, today, we got the Naked 100. Very cool. Now, you can see. Typical Naked 100 labeling. The label is slightly blue, blue tinted, but same, you know, labeling. You got your warnings and stuff. Sorry about my fingernails. Uh, you got your flavor profile, and uh, by the name, very cool. Um, there's a lot of berries in here, and you can see the dropper is actually white. And when I first received the menthol ones, I thought I got counterfeit, you know, Naked 100 e juice, because that's a thing. Um, but now it turns out that it's white because, you know, menthol, the, you know, their menthol selection or whatever, white, it's cool. Oh, goodness gracious, you guys almost see that. Alright, uh, so yeah. Very cool by Naked 100. Now, I have had these for a while, probably about four months now. And, um, well, to give you a quick uh, background thing. Uh, background thing. Uh, some people aren't uh, fans of menthol e-liquids uh, for whatever reason. Um, you know, it can mess with their throats. Uh, you know, stuff like that. You know, some people just aren't you know a huge fan of it. Me personally, I love menthol e-liquids uh, and you know culotta and stuff like that if they're done right. So yeah, um, I did not purchase this e-juice from any of these websites, but I will give you the price and whatnot. So VaporDNA.com, they have it for $19.99, so $20. They have it in 0, 6, and 12, looks like no 3 milligrams. And like I said before, VaporDNA has a reward program, it says earn 2% back with a VaporDNA reward, whatever. I don't know what that is, maybe you do, so yeah, there's that. And the other website is breezy.com. They have it for $19.99, $20. Nicotine, 0, 3, 6, and 12. So they have the three milligrams. And all of them are in stock. And if I didn't mention this before, it's 60 milliliters, uh, both websites. So, yeah. Now, the flavor profile for Very Cool, uh, right here. If you didn't, you know, see the pictures on here already. It's supposed to be Blackberry blueberry and I'm going to assume it's raspberry um, on here it says blackberry blueberry and then fruit so I you know whatever but I'm gonna assume it's raspberry because it looks like a raspberry to me now as you can see I don't have a lot of this left all right so on the small test guys Okay, so I can understand why they gave it the name Very Cool, because it is very cool. Uh, you can definitely smell the menthol. You get a little bit of the fruit too, but it's mostly menthol. You know, that cooling sensation, like Vicks Vapor Rub. Like, imagine you're sniffing that, but like, you know, better smelling, I guess. But yeah, picking up on the menthol. Maybe a little bit of the raspberry. Some kind of berry, maybe it's a blueberry or blackberry, I'm not sure, but yeah. So, you know, smells uh, very uh, cool. No pun intended, uh, I'll delete my account now. Now I have this on the Watofo Lush RDA, um, around 60 watts, two Claptons, basic Claptons, uh, around 0.45 ohms. Now, before I vape this, I do want to say that I, if you're not sure that you um, like menthol or you know e-liquids or whatever, um, I'd probably use this on a dripper instead of a tank because the tanks, um, um, 
well, it's not really the tank in general, since you can't really get to the coil and, like, you know, change the cotton, menthol e-liquids tend to stain the cotton with the, you know, the menthol kind of, you know, flavoring or whatever. So, if you have a problem with that, I definitely recommend, you know, doing it in a dripper so you don't mess up your coil if you don't like the flavor or if you don't like menthol or anything like that. So, yeah, here we go, guys. Now, <laughs> just like the smell test, it's very cool, very cool. Um, definitely get in the menthol right away. Inhale, exhale, everything. Now, I don't seem to have a problem with menthol, vaping menthol at least. So there's not, you know, really a throat hip or any, you know, any coughing issues with this e-liquid with me, but uh, some of you may have that, but no throw hit on my end, uh, three milligrams. Now the taste, um, I'm definitely getting the blackberry, that's for sure. And then I'm getting some raspberry, cause that, that's what it tastes like to me, raspberry. Now, the blueberry, I'm not so sure I'm getting much blueberry, but, you know, it's probably there. I just can't taste it. Now, I don't really normally uh, talk about this in my other reviews, but if you live in like a hot climate, uh, Florida, you know, southern states, stuff like that, um, I love menthol e-juices because it just cools you down, you know, um, it, it just, you know, feels nice, you know, it's a nice summer vape, even though it's not really, you know, summer, um, it just feels nice to, you know, you know, get that menthol feeling, at least for me, I, I enjoy it, um, and also, I, I, I haven't really uh, tested this uh, on myself, but I would assume if, like, you had a cold or something, um, you know, and you're coughing a lot, this would probably, you know, do a decent job because, you know, cough drops are basically menthol anyways. So, you know, you know, maybe that could work. I don't know. Um, yeah, but on the taste... Definitely getting the blackberry. Um a little bit of raspberry. I'm not really uh, tasting blueberry all that much, to be honest. Uh. Uh, this is going to be a long review. Now, nice, smooth liquid. Um, you know, it's nice. Now, for the flavor, the menthol is definitely first, and it's always there. It's not a little bit of menthol, it's a lot of menthol. Um, I do remember when I first got it, the menthol was a lot more intense, but after having it, you know, for a while now, it seems to, you know, kind of, uh, you know, lowered a bit, I guess. I, I don't know, maybe it's because it's steeped. Uh, but, it, you know, it's very prominent. Uh, there's going to be, you're going to get a menthol sensation no matter what. Uh, no matter what you uh, vape this off or whatnot. Um, so the menthol is in front. Now the fruits um, are more like a background note. You can't really um, taste them until you exhale. And what I'm tasting on the exhale is uh, the blackberry and some of the raspberry and not re really getting any uh, blueberry. Now, of course, in real life, um, I do like these fruits. I haven't had a lot of blackberries, though, to be honest, but I know I do like them. Um, but I, you know, I love blueberries. I can't really taste blueberries, though. Um, yeah. Now, I mean, this is a, you know, a tough one to review because I would recommend it if you're into menthol e-juices, um, you know, fruity menthol e-juices. Uh, you know, blackberry, raspberry flavors, and uh, it's a lot of menthol, guys. It's not a little bit, it's a lot. It's very, very cool. Um, 
so yeah, you know, I would recommend it if you're into that, and if you're not, then I definitely wouldn't recommend menthol. Even if you like the fruits, uh, if you don't like menthol at all, don't, you know, don't get this. You're wasting your money. Um, what this tastes like to me, this might, you know, sound kind of weird, but what this tastes like to me is, um, you know that cough syrup, you know, uh, it's like Vicks cough syrup or whatever, um, has, you know, menthol in it. Imagine that, well, you know, there's different flavors, but imagine, like, you know, the berry flavor. Um, but it tastes like that to me, but it, it tastes good, you know? It doesn't taste like cough syrup, but, you know, it has kind of that same feeling to it. You know, base, uh, I, ho I hope you guys know what I'm talking about. But, yeah, it tastes like a Vicks, uh, like, cough syrup to me, but, you know, it tastes good. So, yeah, there's that. Now, what would I give this a uh, 1 out of 5? Um, I'll give it a 4 out of 5. Solid 4 out of 5. I enjoy menthol e-liquids, and if you do too, I definitely recommend this. Um, I like the fruits in here. Um, I wish there was a little bit more of the fruits, maybe. but And uh, I wish I could taste the bl uh, blueberry more. But yeah, I like it. It's 4 out of 5 for me. Um, an all day vape for me, especially living in Florida, and especially if, you know, it's hot out, or during the summertime, whatnot. Um, I definitely recommend this to you guys, but do note it is very, uh, very cool. A lot of menthol in it. So, four out of five guys, it's an all day vape for me. Uh, thanks for watching, guys.